So, a few people have asked me what I think about, you know, Barack Obama getting elected, and I'm like, that's fine, dandy, I really, I don't really have too much of an opinion on it. Anything's better than Bush. Yeah, anything's better than Bush, like my mind just yelled over here. But, I, I don't know, it, him being elected doesn't really concern me so much everyone's reaction to him being elected be it positive or negative everybody seems to have their own little quirky ideas about him and I want to ask a question to Barack Obama that no one seems to you know ask him in these interviews I want to know how he feels about all of the items that have his face on it I want to know does he like is he endorsing any of these products no, I have never mentioned him endorsing the, the whole Barack Obama commemorative plate or the clock or the watches or the plethora of bootleg t-shirts with his name and face all over them. So I want to know, since people seem to think he's a quote-unquote rock star president and that his popularity is gleaming and ever-present everywhere, how does he feel about it? Because he's never really spoken on the topic. He's never really, he's just like, I don't see it that way. I mean, I can understand it, but it, he seems to be like the new, new kids on the block. You remember when new kids on the block first came out, they were like the first band that was just everywhere. You got the new kids on the block, you got the doll, you got the bed sheets. I'm waiting for somebody to come at me with some Barack Obama bed sheets. Like, yeah, I'm gonna put on this Barack Obama mask and I'm going to put on this Barack Obama shirt, and I'm going to go grab up some Barack Obama condoms. There's even a Barack Obama cologne. And I'm like, yo, chill with the Barack Obama stuff. Even the fake stuff. I was walking across this, the bridge, the freaking bridge home, and there was this guy. He's there selling things all the time. And he goes, you know, meet him, meet him, mommy, mommy. And I'm like, please don't meet a meet a mommy mommy. You're selling African art. Why would you meet a meet a mommy mommy me? Spanish people ain't trying to buy African art. So I turn around and there's a bunch of like fake cartoonish characters of Barack Obama. I totally just mispronounced that man's name. Okay. And the one shirt is like two heavyweight boxers in a ring. And Barack has like knocked out John McCain and he's on the ground and like Barack is dancing around him and I'm like now that's just ridiculous this is just stupid come on now people is it really that deep yes, it is. are y'all really that happy no it's really that deep you have to, you have to know your African American history I'm not talking so much about the African American history aspect of it no. I'm talking about how people seem to think that he's going he hasn't even gotten to office yet I'm like waiting to see what he's going to do, but people don't even seem like they're concerned about what he's going to do. They're just happy that he's there. It's been so bad that that's what... Oh, yeah, it's bad. It's been bad. That's <laughs> it can't get any worse. Well, yeah, it could. Well, I don't know. But, I, I mean, like I, I said, feel, we have to wait and see I, what I, even I happens. Feel, I feel because it's been a rough time anyway. It's rough? It's been rough. <laughs> With me and my illness, dealing with a lot of things. So that's been rough. Not due to Bush or, or Barack coming in or anything. It has nothing to do with that. It's just other things like your health, loss of your health, Okay, so yeah. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, I don't know. I don't know what to say about Barack Obama. I just want to know how he feels about all the crap with his name on it. No, I'm not doing shit over again. That's it. Final take. My Barack Obama video.